all scripture is given by inspiration of Yahweh and is profitable for doctrine, for reproof, for correction, for, for instruction, instruction in righteousness, righteousness, that the man of Yah may be complete, thoroughly equipped for every good work. This is Watchman of Yah. I am the Lord God Almighty, and Yahweh is my name. And I say thank you, Felix and Desiree, for sharing those dreams, for putting out those videos. I am coming after these evil shepherds of these days. I am coming after these evil pastors that are leading my children to hell. I am coming after you. My children is going to expose your lies. And then it will be the people's choice if they want to come out or if they want to follow you. Because you pastors, I'm just sending my little children, my lambs, my sheep to hell. You are only doing Satan's will. You were called. I called you out to come do my will. I called you out to come preach to the people. But then you turned your back on me. You started playing around with sin. And you gave the devil a foothold and he took over. And now you're only doing Satan's biddings. And most of you, my spirit has left you. Most of these ch churches... The river Hakadesh is not in them. The river Hakadesh left these churches because they will not do it my way. They will not do it the Holy Trinity's way. They will only do it their way. They will do it. They will do Satan's will. What Satan tells them to do, they will do. And Satan's what? And Satan want many souls to be led to hell because he doesn't want to go alone. So they're doing all that. But I'm going to send my mighty warriors. I'm going to send Felix and Desiree to come out. And they're going to warn the people. I am Yoshua HaMashiach and I beat the wolves away. I'm the only good shepherd. And if you're my sheep, then you will hear my voice. You will hear me calling out to you. My children is going to bring my children out of the dens of the Antichrist. They're going to bring them out of these evil churches. For these churches are only preparing them for the last days. The pastors know the pastor knows better, and he knows what he's doing. He, she, they know what they're doing. They all know that they're doing this for Satan. They're no longer serving me anymore. You say that the real Hakadesh is in you. You're preaching, or you're prophesying, or you're praying under the real Hakadesh anointing. What anointing is in you? Because if you had the anointing in you, if you had my real Hakadesh in you, you will not be able to do all this. You will not be able to do it because you will not be able to stand it or bear it. You will quickly confess and tell the people you're lying. You are lying to the people. You are feeding them crap. That's what you're feeding them. You're supposed to give them the word of God, my word. But you're preaching them. You're telling them anything you want to tell them. That's not what I called you for. But it's okay. I am Yahweh and I will judge. I will judge all these evil false people. Prophets, false pastors, and false leaders of these days. I will judge you. This world is getting more evil, and the hearts of men is becoming more colder, and the evil persists. The evil one becomes more evil. My children, my soldiers, my mighty warriors become more holy, and they burn brighter and brighter. This world is getting more darker, and I bring in my little sheep out of this. I am bringing them out. Because when my son Yeshua comes, he is coming to take his bride home. And my children will be warned. And if they want to listen to what Felix and Desiree has to say, what my two anointed ones have to say, then they can come and listen. Then they can come and be mentored. And they can come and learn the truth if they want to. But if they want to follow these pastors, these evil pastors of these days, then let them. Because they made up their mind. They made up their choice. Many people... Many people will not like to hear what you're going to have to say because they've been with these pastors and they, tr and they trusted these pastors more. But I tell you what, that if they're not ready to leave these pastors, then it's going to be dangerous for them because these pastors is only leading them to hell. They're only doing what Satan tells them to do. 
Nothing more, and I am coming after these evil shepherds of these days. I am coming after you. I will beat these pastors away. I will beat these wolves away from my children. Then it will be the people's choice to choose if they want to follow me or if they want to follow the devil. In a great tribulation, it will be so easy for people to fall for the devil's trick because they've been preparing them for this. And if you're not spiritually equipped, then how can you win this war? How can you win this war? Because Satan's evil force is going to be up there. The Antichrist is going to be out there. And he is going to use great mind control on people. And yes, if you don't have the real Hakadesh in you, you will fall. If you've been sinning all this time, if not been taking notice, if you have not been serving me all this time, then you will not be spiritually equipped because the last days is coming very swiftly. My son Yoshua is coming very soon. He is coming quickly to take my children out of this evil world. When I look at this world, I only see some few sparkles that sparkles in this world. The majority follow Satan. The majority follow Satan. Only so few follows me. This world has blinded their eyes. They don't know that they're being led to a trap. And I am sending my children to warn them and to let them know that they're being led to a trap. Oh, you fools and simple ones. When will you come and learn? When will you listen and stop following these evil pastors, these evil shepherds? They are no good. They don't have the spirit of God in them. They don't have the Ruba Hakadesh inside of them. Some of them have been taken over by the evil spirits. Some of them has been have had a walk in in them. Some of them still have a choice to repent, but they don't want to because they get all the money. They lie to get all the money. They don't care about taking care of my sheep. They don't care about that. They only care about the money. These pastors are getting rich. My son Yoshua was on this earth when he was preaching. He wasn't stealing money from the people. He wasn't collecting money from the people. Instead, he did my will. As for these pastors, they are no pastor. They are just thieves, robbers. That's that's what I see you like. You're just thieves and robbers and wolves just to devour my sheep and I will beat you away from my sheep, from my children, from my little ones and they will come out. If they are my sheep, they will come out. We will see because I have put the inviting sword and my little ones will come out and the rest will stay back. I am separating the wheat from the tares. I am separating the goats from the sheep and I'm going to take all my children out of the dens of the Antichrist. They will be warned. You are warned. My children is coming out to preach to the people. And if you don't like the words that they have to say, all you have to do is close your ears. You don't have to listen to it because it wasn't for you. I have warned many times about the great tribulation, about the zombies that will arise, and many people does not believe. They think that I'm lying to them. But the elites know that it's true. That's why they're preparing their underground homes. But the funniest thing about them, they think that they can hide away from my judgment. They think that if they hide underground or if they secure their place with 20,000 bricks and iron, they'll be able to hide away from me. They don't know that they're building their homes up. They're building it in vain because I'm going to destroy their homes. I'm going to destroy everything that they made. I'm going to destroy their food houses and their storehouses and everything that they prepared. They say, ha, huh, see, we prepared ourselves for the great tribulation. Now we will be safe. But they don't know that I am Yahweh and I see all and I know all and I know where you are hiding. My judgment is about to be released on this earth. My judgment is about to be released on this earth. I am about to cleanse this world. I am about to get rid of the evil that's in this world because these evil human beings, or some of them not even human anymore, has polluted my earth. Their hearts is hardened. Their hearts is seared. 
And that's why it's so easy for them to do evil. It's so easy for them to do whatever Satan tells them to do. That's because they've been taken over. They have been taken over. And the real Hakadesh is no longer in them. Because my real Hakadesh will warn. She will tell them to stop what they are doing. But they, but she has left them a long time ago. These evil ones of these days, these evil politicians of these days, the evil government, I will judge the government. I will judge these evil politics of these days. I am the real judge. I am the real jury. And I will judge all these evil ones. All these evil politicians are just plants to trap the people. They're only doing what Satan tells them to do. And they're all in agreement. They are all in unity. They are all playing sides. And in the end, they're all doing Satan's will. And the people is falling for these evil ones trick. But I will judge the government. I, Yoshua, say the government is on my shoulders. In my hand, you are so tiny. Yet, you are so full of pride. You are the evil and pompous ones. You are the ones that stink. You stink to me because of all your evil. When my children look at you, they can see the evil that's in you, the filth that's in you. There are so many evil politicians of these days, but I will handle them myself. They cannot stop doing evil, and evil is pleasure to them. I am not a god to be mocked. I am to be feared, and these pompous ones think that they are to be feared. I will show them who is Yahweh. I will show them who is God. I will show them who's the real boss here. I will show them. For I will always put down the evil ones. I will put down the prideful ones. I will put down the ones that put themselves on a pedestal. I will put down, I will bring down the people that everyone worship. I will bring disaster their way. I will bring Deuteronomy 28 curses on them. The people will see them and will show them disgust. They will not be respected anymore. I will do this very soon. The ones that get worshipped the most, you will see, you will see that I will rip their maxes off of their face and they will be ashamed. You will see what I, Yahweh, will do. You think you're the most prettiest. You think you're the most good looking ones. You don't know that you look like a dead skeleton in my eyes. You don't know that you stink to me. You don't know that you are filthy and disgusting in my eyes. Look at the evil that you have done. Look at the evil that you allow. Look at the evil. You are so free. You think I will not catch you? I will catch you. You think I have not set a trap for you? I have set a trap for you. If you think that you have set a trap for the people, wait till what I, Yahweh, has to say. I have set a trap for you too. And you will fall in my trap. Just like I set a trap for Haman, I set a trap for Pharaoh, I, tra I set a trap for all the evil ones in, in, in the Bible, I will set a trap for you. I set a trap for my enemies, and I will always bring a way. I will set a trap for you too, and you will fall in my trap. In the end, you are all doing my will. Just like Pharaoh did my will, you would do my will. Just how Haman did my will, you would do my will too. I toy with my enemies, and I will toy with you. You are just like puppets in my hand. Yes, you were born for destruction. Just like all the evil ones in the Bible were, they were born for destruction. You were born for destruction too. You are only there to play out what has been predestined. But what did you gain in this world? What did you gain in the world in the end? Nothing. You only have riches, some riches that will fade away, that will pass away, that will soon die. That's what you got for yourself. What do you store it for yourself? For eternity. You think Satan will give you something? He's not going to give you anything since he is under my feet. Do you know that your eternity in hell, your eternity, your next home is going to be hell and a lake of fire? In this world, all you have is riches. All you have is praises. You can say that you look good in this world. But what do you have in the end? It's a shame. 
It's a big shame. You stored it for yourself, evil and wickedness. I will show you evil and wickedness. I am the God. I am Yahweh, and I will not change for no man, woman, or child. I said before that if you store up mercy for yourself, I will show you mercy. If you store up righteousness for yourself, I will be good to you. If you store evil for yourself, I will show you evil too. You keep storing for yourself judgment. You keep storing up for yourself evil and wickedness, and I will show you it. I am Yahweh, and I am a God to be feared. I am Yahweh, and that is my name. I will not be mocked. You are only mocking yourself. You think you have the upper hand. You will see who has the upper hand in the end, when I will be laughing at you, and you will know that I am laughing at you. We will see then who has the upper hand, if it, if it is you or is it me. I am Yahweh, and I am not to be mocked. I am Yahweh, and I will not share my glory with no man or woman. The government is on my shoulders, and I will judge. Look at the evil that's in this world. Look at the children of these last days. The children that I spoke about in the Bible. That is fulfilling. The children of these last days is evil. They are evil. They are wicked. They are vicious. They have been taken over. The parents of these days are useless. They are useless. You have little demons running around in your homes. Little demons running around. The parents see this. They do not care. They don't know that the children that they are raising, they're going to backfire on them one day. They're going to turn against the people. They're going to turn against the parents. Because the parents stopped doing what I told them to do, because they became very mild and soft with their children, they became, they started acting like friends towards their children. And this is what they get. You don't treat your children as a friend. I gave you the authority to punish your kids. I warned you in Proverbs many times to correct your child. Every parent knows what to do because if you're a real parent, I gave you something in you that a parent supposed to have. But most of you ignore most of you ignore this spirit that I gave to you. And now you only do what you want to do. You have so many excuses why you do not discipline your children. And I am talking about these evil parents of these days. Their children will be used in the last days. Their children will be used in a great tribulation. The Antichrist will use them. They will be used. They are traitors. They are evil. They are rebellious. They are cold-hearted. They do not care. They are murderers. They are backstabbers. They are not people to be trusted. This is the children of the last days. And they are here in this world today. I say woe, woe, woe be unto this world. For the children of these last days are very vicious. They are, the, they are your worst nightmares. They are your worst enemies. I say woe be unto this world. This world does not know what is about to happen. You go on the news. You see on the news all these bad children. They are reserved for the last days. These, these children are traitors. These evil children are traitors. They will be used in the last days. There are even some that cost us some of my children. They say they're Christians, but they have some evil children in their homes. They have some demonic children in their homes. But these people that call themselves, Oh, I'm a Christian. But look at your children. Your children is not saved. Your children is evil. They are evil. They are traitors. But they come out every Sunday to say that they're Christian. When your children are despicable in my eyes. You give them candy and cookies. You give them everything they want. You give them their way. You don't know the danger you're putting yourself in. And this is the parents' faults. I warned you. I warned you about your children. And now that they became very evil and evil, wicked, stubborn children, you are now complaining. Don't run to me because I already told you what you should do. For some of you, it's too late to go back. So go back and start disciplining them. But I said these children are going to be used in the last days. In the great tribulation, they will be used. You are warned.
I know most of you will not listen to what I have to say, but you are warned. I warned you about your children. I warned you about the, the false pastors of these days. I warned you about the great tribulation. It's your choice to listen if you want. I say, world, you are warned. And this is all I have to say. And I say thank you, Felix and Desiree, for seeing those videos. And now it's a people's choice if they, if they want to believe it or not. My mighty warriors are sending these messages out. And I say thank you. And if people, you are warned. You should be prepared for the last days if you want to be. My children here that's bringing out these messages, these warnings, they're not lying. They're only telling you the truth. They're not doing for fame and fortune like these pastors do. They're not gaining anything or taking money from you, from you like these pastors do. All they're doing is telling you the message, and if you want to listen, you can listen. If you don't, if you don't want to listen, you don't have to listen because this message was never for you. If you have, to, if you have an ear, hear what I am telling you. Hear what I am trying to say to you. I am trying to bring you out of these cages that the evil ones have put you in. These evil pastors have put you in. I am trying to bring you into the light. Trying to bring you into the truth. But it's your choice if you want to do it. Because I have other children to focus on right now. I have other things to deal with. But I want to bring you out. And I, and I am using my children to do this. And my will will be done. And that's it. That's my dream. All praise, honor, and glory for this message goes to the Holy Trinity, Abba Yahweh, Yahushua, and the Ruach HaKodesh, a.k.a. Shekinah Glory, a.k.a. the Holy Spirit. Remember, Remember the, Lord the Lord chastises, chastises, which is to correct those He loves. If this message is a blessing to you, like and subscribe and share with someone you love.